Today, we're diving into something seriously cool. Running AI inference workloads supercharged with GPUs, all on the magic of Cloud Run. All right, I'm already logged into the Google Cloud console and I've got Cloud Shell ready to go. First things first, we need to tell Google Cloud where we're working. We'll set our project ID in the region where our Cloud Run service will live. And super important note, for this to work, your project needs billing enabled, and you need to have requested and been granted GPU quota. All right, next up, we need to flip the light switches on for a few essential services. We're enabling the APIs for Artifact Registry, where we'll store our container image, Cloud Build, our automated builder, Cloud Run itself, and Cloud Storage. So let's create a repository right now in Artifact Registry with the gcloud artifacts repositories create command. And this will hold our upcoming AI inference container where our application will live. All right, now for the heart of our application. I've got a simple application folder here containing a Docker file. This file is like a recipe for building the container. I hope it's delicious. Now let's peek inside. This Docker file uses the popular Olama inference server as a base. We're setting some environment variables, downloading the Gemma model files directly into the image, which will lead to a faster startup later, and finally telling it how to start the Olama server when the container runs. All right, time to build using the gcloud builds submit command. We tag our image so artifact registry knows where to put it. And notice this machine type flag. We're telling cloud build to use a beefier virtual machine for the build process itself. More CPU, more network bandwidth means a much faster build, especially when downloading those model files. So let's kick that off. Now, this might take a few minutes depending on the model size and the builder machine. So grab a coffee, a tea, or try to beat your high score on asteroids while you wait. And voila, build complete. Cloud Build has packaged our application and pushed the container image straight into the artifact registry repository we created earlier. Nice. Okay, the moment we've been waiting for, deploying to Cloud Run with GPU power. For that, we use the gcloud run deploy command. So check out these flags. We have image, which points to the container image we just built in artifact registry, GPU, and here's the magic. We specify type equals NVIDIA L4 to request that specific GPU. And then there's memory and CPU. We need to give our service enough resources to handle the model and the GPU. And then max instance equals one. Super important. Since GPU quota is often limited, especially when starting out, we're setting the maximum number of instances to one to match the quota we have available in this project and region. This prevents Cloud Run from trying and failing to scale beyond our GPU capacity. If you have more quota, you can increase this. So let's deploy. Cloud Run is now pulling our image, provisioning an instance with the attached L4 GPU and getting everything ready. And there we have it, our service URL. Now by default, Cloud Run services require authentication. For quick testing from our local machine or Cloud Shell here, we can't just hit that public URL directly without handling authentication tokens. A nice little trick is to use the gcloud run services proxy command. This creates a local proxy that automatically handles adding the necessary authentication header to our requests. So let's start that in a separate Cloud Shell tab. And with the proxy running, we can now use a simple curl command to talk to our service through the proxy. We're sending a prompt to the Olama endpoint running inside our Cloud Run container. And would you look at that? The Gemma model running on a GPU managed by Cloud Run is streaming back the response right here in our terminal. AI inference, serverless style. Sounds like an off menu item at a fast food joint. So let's quickly jump over to the Cloud Console UI for visual confirmation. We navigate to Cloud Run, find our newly deployed service, and we can click into the Logs tab to see the output from our container, which is very helpful for debugging. And if we check the configuration or revision details, we can see it all laid out. 
It's using the NVIDIA L4 GPU. And notice CPU allocation and pricing is set to instance-based billing. This is required when using GPUs. And there's our max instances setting correctly configured. Everything looks great. And just like that, you've configured and deployed a containerized AI application using the Olama server and Gemma model accelerated by an NVIDIA L4 GPU all running serverlessly on Cloud Run. You get the power of GPUs when you need them and the scalability and ease of use of Cloud Run. That's the stuff that dreams are made of right there. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Thank you.